Hey, Tony here. Today I want to show you all of my pickups for the month of July, so stick around. So the month of July was a pretty busy month. Um, we had the Criterion sale, we had some Arrow releases, we had some Disney releases. So I thought I would take time today to show you all of the items that I picked up in the month of July. Um, so I thought I would go ahead and just get started. Um, I'm going to just start with the Disney Movie Club. Um, so I got the Big Green. So we do have some more new releases um, for the Disney Movie Club exclusives. So this is a great new addition. Tom and Huck. I'm very happy to have this one in the collection. I do have the DVD that I can retire now. Man of the House. And a King in King Arthur's Court. So very happy to have those. Now from Shout Factory and Screen Factory, I got Stephen King's The Dead Zone with a slip and the poster. Brotherhood of the Wolf with a slip and a poster. House of Wax with this slip. And City Stickers 2, The Legend of Curly's Gold from Shout Select. So very happy to have those in the collection. Okay, next up I'm going to show you the Arrow releases that I finally received. Um, I got the Stylist. I've heard a lot of good things about this one. So I'm very happy that I picked that one up. I got the um, Bird with the Crystal Plumage. This right here is the 4K release, standard box edition. And I was also able to get the um, limited edition artwork release. So very happy that I finally was able to receive that. I got Major Dundee. For a lot of good things about this one, I'm definitely looking forward to checking that one out. I've got Years of Lead, five classic Italian crime thrillers from 1973 to 1977. Very happy to have this nice box set. One very exciting release is this True Romance um, on 4K. Um, I ordered mine from Zavi and received this one. I also ordered the Still Book, but I have not received that one yet. Um, I also got Demons, the single 4K box um, edition, and Demons 2. So very happy to have that. I did recently see Demons um, last month, I do believe. And it was a very, um, I wasn't really sure what to expect, but I'm very happy that I actually have this one in the collection. Okay, next up I'm going to show you my Zavi pickups. I did get the Titans of Cult Space Jam Edition. So very happy to have this one. This right here is a 4K release. Um, I do have all of the Titans of Cult collections now, except for the very first one that they released. Um, I'm trying to remember what it was. I think it's Blade Runner, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I got the Smoking the Bandit still book. Very happy to have this one. I did an unboxing of that if you want to check it out. I got the Shrek 4K edition from the UK. The Deer Hunter. So all of these you'll find um, unboxings of on my channel if you want to check them out. Um, Mortal Engines. Scott Pilgrim vs. The World. Looper on 4K. So I did watch this one this week. Really enjoyed the movie. I'd never seen Looper before. I've heard great things about it. And so I took time to watch it this week and um, just thought it was a really good movie. I was expecting more time travel from the movie, but um, overall I really liked it. Okay, I got X-Men The Last Stand with the lenticular magnetic card. Also, I got X-Men the first um, X-Men First Class with, with the lenticular, and X-Men Days of Future Past with the lenticular. And I also finally received my um, um, Last Action Hero with this box set with a still book from Zavi. So happy to have that one in the collection. Okay, next up, I'm going to show you my Kino Lorber pickups for the month. Um, I'm, I've got I'm Going to Get You Sucker for, um, from Kino. Um, I've seen this movie in the past. I really enjoyed it. And when I saw that this was released, I picked it up. They shoot horses, don't they? Hero and the Terror. Where the Boys Are. Before and After. Ten Little Indians. Battle Him, Jetsons the Movie, 
Teen Witch, and the Rawhead Rex Steelbook. Very happy to have this one. Okay, next up I'm going to show you what I picked up from um, the UK, uh, some more UK releases. I got Wild Search from Eureka and the Millionaire Express from Eureka. So very happy to have those. Um, these right here are from Second Sight. I got Lake Mungo. I've heard a lot of good things about this one, so I'm looking forward to checking that one out. And I got the Babadook set um, on 4K. So very happy to have that one. And then from 101 Films, I received my um, Hell Knight. So this right here is number 20 in the line. So I am 100% up to date on those. Okay, next up I'm going to show you some regular Blu-ray releases. I got the Paper Tigers. I've heard a lot of great things about this one. I'm looking forward to checking that one out. Die in a Gunfight. Initiation. Jacob's Wife. Open Water 3 Film Collection I picked up at Walmart. And I finally just ordered Once Upon a Deadpool. Um, from what I understand, this is really getting hard to find. I never did own this one because it didn't come with a slip. So I was always waiting for a good price on this one. Never could find a good price. So I went ahead and just bit the bullet and bought this one while I saw that it was available. Also, I picked up um, Buster and Billy. Now this right here is an old film from, um, I say an old film, this is probably early 80s if I'm not mistaken. Um, I saw this when I was younger, really enjoyed the movie. And so um, I saw that this was being released from, I guess, from um, BusterAndBilly.com. Um, so I picked it up because I wanted this one in the collection. I did watch it. It still holds up. They did a really good job of the restoration. Um, I picked up When the Wind Blows. I got this from Deep Discount for a pretty good price. I watched this one. Very interesting animated movie. Check it out if you haven't seen it. Um, Finding Forrester. American Gods Season 3. And I also got the Smokey and the Bandit 7 movie collection from Walmart with a slip. So this is a DVD release. Okay, we still got quite a few titles left. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got from the Criterion sale. Just real quick, I'm just going to run through these. Um, I got Limelight. The Great Dictator. Um, Monjour Verdo. Lady Snowblood, The Samurai Trilogy, Lone Wolf and Cub, Bringing Up Baby, Oh Joy, Deep Cover, um, Nightmare Alley, Pick Up on South Street. Ghost World, 1984, Man Push Cart, The Tree of Life, E2 Mama Tambien, The Furies. Now the next few criterion I'm going to show you are the ones that I actually watched during the month that I picked up. Rebecca. Um, this is an Alfred Hitchcock film. I watched this one, really enjoyed it. It was great. Memories of Murder is another great one that I'm glad I got. Don't know exactly what's happening with this slip, and um, with this insert, so I need to fix that. Blowout is another great film. Happy to have this one in the collection. Really enjoyed watching that. And then here are some of the Charlie Chaplin films I watched. I watched The Kid, probably my favorite out of the ones that I saw. Gold Rush is another great one. Circus, the circus was great. City Lights was pretty good. It was good. Um, Modern Times was good. And Fast Times at Ridgemont High. I really enjoyed this one, revisiting this one. Okay, next up I'm going to show you my Best Buy exclusive still books I picked up. I got A Quiet Place Part 2. Spiral from the Book of Saul. Howard the Duck. Space Jam on 4K, Snatch 4K, Almost Famous, 
and Mortal Kombat. Okay, the next up I'm going to show you um, just some, I guess, studio releases from the Vestron Video um, Collector Series. I got the Wraith. Really nice looking slipcover on this one. From um, Kino Lorber, I got Track Down. Stranger on the Run. The Valdez Horses. Coogan's, Coogan's, Coogan's Bluff. Really nice looking slipcover. The Indian Runner. From Paramount Presents, I got 48 Hours and another 48 Hours. Almost Famous. Last Train from Gun Hill. From MVD Video, I got Mortuary, um, the Mortuary release with a slip, and the house on Sorority Row. Okay, just a few more titles, some 4K releases. I got Dead and Buried with a lenticular slip. Got three different copies of that because they were all variations. So happy to have these. I got Scott Pilgrim vs. the World with this beautiful slip. Space Jam. Howard the Duck. From eBay, I did get Peter Rabbit with the 4K release. I wanted to have this one in the collection. I only had the standard edition. Um, and then the deal of the month probably was G.I. Joe and G.I. Joe. Um, so G.I. Joe, The Rise of Cobra, and G.I. Joe Retaliation from Walmart. Um, one of these was, I think the um, first one was $9.99, and Retaliation was $14.99, which is a really good deal, especially with the $9.99 deal. But those are all my pickups for the month of July. I know that there's quite a bit. I know that a lot of you might have gotten some of these. So please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about my July pickups. And also let me know which of these that you picked up in your collection and added to your collection. I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and on TikTok. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.